Pisces, I hope you're doing well. My name is Lisa. Se siento muy raro hablar en inglés en estos videos de decir. Today's video, as you must have seen, uh, this is my first video speaking English. I'm introducing myself again. Um, Lisa, I'm 19, I'm Venezuelan and Colombian, and uh, right now I'm living in Bogota, Colombia. Um, well, I love makeup. And most of the people that I follow that inspire me to start with makeup has been English speakers. And uh, so I got inspired by a lot of them. And uh, I've been learning how to speak English since I was a child. So the, uh, for me, it's easier to get inspired by, by them because they were the ones that started to I started to see and I started to say, okay, I, I love this and I want this. Uh, I started making like two years, two, two years and a half. I don't know, I don't remember. I've spoken with some people that are pretty nice and I really like and support me and I really appreciate that. So I wanted to do this for those who support me and, and I don't have a YouTube channel in English. This is my only channel so I thought that it would be fun and great to do a video speaking English I'm kind of nervous because I don't know I'm super nervous <laughs> uh, but well uh, I did this makeup and it was crazy on my Instagram and Twitter I started to have a lot of DMs from you guys thank you so much I really appreciate it uh, so I'm gonna do a tutorial about it um, well let's start I'm gonna put this because I don't want my hair to go all over my my face while I do my makeup. Well, first of all, skincare. I'm gonna use a moisturizer first. My skin's super dry, so I use a lot of moisturizing. I I think that drain my face a lot. I use this. Also, I bought lots and lots and lots of masks. I bought these ones and I'm gonna try them, try them all. Leave a comment down below if you want me doing a video trying them and telling you what I think about. Of course, I won't try them all in one day because I want to know, know how they react on my face because it would be super responsible from, my, from me. Telling you know this is great and I'm just used once. So well that's all this is starting to go into my face and now I'm gonna use this. This is aloe vera and I really like it because it's pretty good. It it puts your face like firm and it hydrates too. I can open it. So I'm gonna use this gel, so I'm gonna use just that. I like when I put my products and I put it uh, right away. Just warm that a little bit. Um, put them on my face. Let's start with, with the magic, with the makeup. And I use this primer by e.l.f., this hydrating primer. Uh, it's it just helps me with my dry skin, but it's not really the best for the makeup to last. It's not my favorite. I want to try some ones. If you know some some other primers that would work on my skin, dry skin, uh, let me know down below and I will be glad to, to try them and let you know if they work for me or not. I'm going to take my, my beauty blender. This one is not a beauty blender, it's just that I always say beauty blender, just... I don't know. <laughs> this is Ponch is by BYS Cosmetics, I really like it, it's pretty big. And it's wet, not too much, but if you, if you put a lot of water on them, it will be like this. It's super big and I like that because it makes the, the foundation thing faster. 
Also, I'm gonna use my color pop. I use a medium 90. This is a non filter foundation, it's pretty affordable. I think it's $12, $6. I always forget it. I did a review of it on my channel, but it's in Spanish. If you want to see it, you're welcome. I'm gonna leave the thing here. So I'm gonna apply this on my face pretty fast because with this I'm gonna take a lot of time because I want to explain you pretty well. I did my makeup yesterday and this is glue from the lashes. I'm, I've been trying to take it away but it has been pretty difficult actually. Just gonna put a little bit of concealer to put some setting powder to start with my eyes. This is by Colourpop 2 by the way, this is a light tan. I like to, to use pretty 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 lighter concealers than my, than my skin tone. I always blend first the one that I want not to be so noticed. I always start with this, 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 this and then I finish with with my under eyes. And I'm gonna use my By IS HD Micro Finish Powder. I really like this one actually. It's pretty it's pretty thin, it's super light. I don't feel it at all. What I don't like is that it doesn't have it has flashback. So that's not pretty great actually. And I just use it for looks that I'm gonna do like this or that I'm gonna just take pictures but if I'm gonna go out I don't use it at all of course because I don't like it. I don't like to bake I just do it when I do my foundation first and uh, what it's left here I put it all over my face. The same concealer, the No Filter Concealer by Colourpop Light Tan. I like to use it too as a base for for the for the eyeshadows. However, I'm waiting for the new ABH eye primer and Alisa Edwards Club uh, to arrive to Colombia to buy it right away and use it on my channel. Still there, my eyes are not pretty big. Damn, this glue is awful. If you know a tip to take away this, please let me know. Someone told me about coconut oil, but I don't like. I I don't. It doesn't feel well on my skin, so. I don't like to use coconut oil for my skin. Okay. Okay. The eyeshadow palette I use is the Riviera palette by ABH. I really like it. I like the colors. I'm um, I'm always do, and I'm trying to change that. But I'm all almost always use pink and purples to do my makeup, and that's what I did. Uh, this was inspired, by the way, by Adele. I really love her. She has always inspired me with lots of things that she has done, and this one is the one that she did the slash makeup. Um, well, I did it before. But I wanted to do it again. Start with the purple. This is Canes. Canes. So I'm gonna start with it. I always pack the colors with top tapping top motions like this. And I don't like to blend with the same brush, but I just do a little bit of circular motions like this on the corners. And then I use a lot of brushes to, to blend. I use this one that 
and that the Riviera palettes comes with because it's pretty fluffy and uh, it's really nice I really like it and I use this one none of them has eyeshadows on it I don't like to to put anything to blend I like to use a clean brush for it I, even though I'm not gonna use it until here I like to do this because it will blend better when I do that. Also, the purple will be a little bit loose while we blend, but you just have to add a little bit more and that's all, don't worry. Now I take this one And I just do the same, but not so little motions, like big motion. I do big motions like this. Change a lot my blending game using like more brushes and clean brushes to blend. It helps me a lot. It takes more time, but blending girl, blending is important in life. If I'm saying something wrong, you know I. I wasn't born speaking English, no, 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 uh, I speak Spanish almost all the time, well, no, I speak English almost all the time for my work, because I work in a, in a call center, so I speak English almost always, so, um, if I see something wrong, let me know, but be nice, don't be rude, because if you're being rude, that's not helping, that's not criticizing in a, in a proper way. Uh, I mean, I think that someone tells you that you're some, doing something wrong in a good way, it's really great, I really appreciate that, because uh, it's not letting you to do something wrong and you look ridiculous no uh, you know you have to learn that's how you learn doing th things wrong you know and well that's all what I want to say I take this brush that I used to to put my to clean my eyebrows and <laughs> put my eye shadows base and I take some micellar work this is the Garnier one and well I put it here well you can notice that I use it a lot <laughs> um, I use it yesterday that's why it's not clean because well, I woke up and I start to do makeup and well I just put the brush there and I clean it a little bit I mean the excess of of the of the micellar water and with it, I cut this like this, like a slash. Then you take more concealer. I just put a little bit. Um, then you put it again. <laughs> One of my favorite shades, I don't know if, if it's noticed, but it's the one that it's more, it has been more used. That one, and I think Palermo and Seychelles, and of course Sales, because it's, I think it's the best way I've ever tried before. We'll take Bahamas, and as we did with this, we will do tap motions to apply it. This helps a lot to have the most pigmentation that the eyeshadow can give you. However, even though that I'm doing this, this is pretty pigmented. I mean, this eyeshadow palette is really great. I think the, less, the least pigmented is Palm. And Palm, I always use it to mix some of the shadows to make it darker and give deepness to my eye. I don't know if that's okay. Profundidad, deepness. But I think that is different when we are talking about makeup. I I don't know, girl. I don't know. I don't know. Okay, now I do this, and as I said before, 
I do some circular motions, mini circular motions on the corners to soft a little bit. I take this clean brush and I do this. And I like to do my eyes look like this. I really like that. I feel like it's my first video. I mean, the first time that I took a video, I was like, hey, hola, mi nombre es Lisa, y yo tengo 18. I think that I had 18 at that time. Yes, I had 18. But well, that was me taking my first video. <laughs> I don't know if you don't like the Spanglish, but I love Spanglish, and when I can do Spanglish, I will speak Spanglish. So I'm gonna continue. This is how it finished. Well, now I'm gonna take cells, the white shadow from the Rubira palette. Now I'm gonna take out. Uh, all that color I put under, I put under my eyes. Now I'm gonna take that purple again, case, and I'm gonna try to mix it with Bahamas. And also I will put it in this eye right here. You don't have to worry, I know this, this looks bad right now, it will not later. Now we take Bahamas and we put it right here. This with this and this. It would be nice to go together but I don't really like it too much. Shut up! Well, that's how it looks like now. There is someone doing that fucking sound that I'm. I want to kill him. Uh, as you notice, this is mixed together. Look at this issue that I have with canes, with the purple one. Uh, it's pretty difficult to mix with other shades. When you work with them by itself, it's really good. It. You can. I I've worked with it with. Bahamas, but when you put more because you want it to be more purple than pink It starts to look patchy. It starts to look really Look at this It starts to look patchy after So so what I do is that I don't apply more even when I want more pigmentation Because it's gonna look awful. It will look really really bad if I continue up do more, Doing more 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 and more well, now I'm gonna do my face. I'm gonna finish my face. Uh, I use as a bronzer this BYS blusher. This is the perfectly peachy. Look at this tone, I really like it. And I use this brush to apply it. I like to apply it super, like, here is where my, my highlighter goes. And I start to do it like this. And when you blend it, uh, it starts to go where it, it's supposed to and it's really nice I like it and it looks your face look at this just a little bit of bronzer bronzer and that's all I have this lash this is by Pau, Pau Tips I don't know if you know her she lives in LA but she's Colombian and she does some she has a channel on English and she has a channel on Spanish and she has a channel of vlogs but she's really cute and nice and she grabbed this 
make a blind of her. The cute thing about this blush is that it is, it is, yeah, well, it is powder, like, it's powder, but when you touch it, it starts to be creamy, and look at this, it's, it's a cream. Look how it was left here, because I touched it. I don't know if you can notice. It's powder. It's powder. Now, it's cream, you know? So, I like it because I have dry skin again. Um, and it makes my face look a little bit more hydrated, a little bit more alive. Now I use this to contour my face. I like a really good contour face. I have a fucking big for forehead, so you have to contour that here. You have to because it's super big. I like to use it as a highlighter, but when I use it, I don't use it by itself. I use it with inheritance too, when I want to use highlighter with color highlighters like pink, green, things like that. I mix it with this because I don't know, I think it looks better. Look at that highlighter. And for the tip of my nose, I just will use inheritance. Look at this. I really like it, really, really, really like it. Let's go for the lips. And I like them to look very big. And I like to do this. To be kind of blended inside of my lips. And I will use this tone. This is a nude, a pretty light nude. My skin tone. And I have this lip plumper. This is by Catrice Cosmetics. This is the Volumizing Lip Booster. It has mint. So it makes your lips like, you know. I'm sexy. Okay, no, no, I'm not. And uh, well, look at those lips, big lips. Well, now let's go with the lashes. I always, always, I always curl my lashes because they are like this. Have you seen uh, the lashes of Donkey? That's those are my lashes that they look like this. Look that I try to go them up and they go down like right away. That's why I have my mascara always on my hand while I do this. In order when I finish curling, I just open it and right away I apply it before they go down. Now. 
the falsies. Um, I'm gonna apply them out of camera and then I'm gonna continue this video. Showing you without this bandana. I don't know the name in English and I will call him Patan. So this is the makeup. <laughs> so this is the makeup. What the fuck is going on with this lash? I need new lashes. Comment down below which which lashes do you do you like in order for me to know and try them out. I love this highlight. It's really good. The light doesn't let me show you, but it's really good. So this was the makeup that I did, that you like a lot, I really appreciate it, love you all, uh, subscribe uh, and take the notifications because I know that there will be more videos in English. Uh, well, I'm waiting for the, for the new collection of ABH Plus and Alisa, Alisa Edwards to arrive in order for do a video and review on English for y'all. I hope you like it. See you. Love ya.